What is up YouTube? It's your homeboy Josh back with another video. For today we're going to be talking about Instacart and being on the waitlist for Instacart. Now, this um you know Instacart is same with, uh, it's the same with like DoorDash and Grubhub. And Instacart focuses on delivering groceries door to door. Now, what does it mean to be on the waitlist with Instacart. So basically, if you're applying as a shopper slash driver for Instacart, if your application goes to the waitlist, that means that the demand in your area, according to your zip code, is not that high. Okay. So basically, for example, if I applied as a shopper slash driver for Instacart using my zip code, and then the demand, the customer's demand on my zip code is not that high, I would be put on the wait list. So basically, that's what it means if Instacart puts you in your wait list after you have signed up to be a shopper slash driver for them. So if that happens, you got to understand that the customers in your area or the number of customers in your area rather is not that high like it hasn't reached the required level for instacart to open up the shopper slash driver program in your area so basically that's it for today's video thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'm gonna see you on the next one this is your homeboy josh out